Birds of prey are phenomenal hunters, and different species of birds use different techniques and tactics to hunt and kill their prey. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god. <laughs> Sometimes they even fight over a kill, and if you want to see action on the ground, in the water, and in the skies, this is it. So let's get started. Number 15. Goshawk preying on duck. After landing on a duck's back, a hawk keeps its talons planted into the duck's back while it plucks its feathers out. The duck is still alive, but incapable of escaping. It looks like the bell has rung for this poor duck. A goshawk attacks a duck in mid-air and manages to latch onto its prey without too much trouble before landing on it, in some sort of parking lot. In this spectacular video, a hawk goes for the kill in the water when it spots a duck sunbathing. The duck tries to defend itself, but it's a waste of time against such a powerful predator. I have seen ducks defend their ducklings against seagulls, but a hawk is a bird of prey that's on an entirely different level. A goshawk tries to catch some ducks, but they manage to escape. The man filming didn't know what happened afterwards because he couldn't see where the birds had flown with his camera's viewfinder. I guess the ducks found a safe hiding space where the goshawk couldn't go. Number 14. Marsh Harrier Outwits Coot In this video, a hunting marsh harrier exhausts a submerged coot to use as a meal. The marsh harrier is a very lazy and apathetic raptor that does not hunt very often. It prefers easy prey such as young shorebirds and injured or sick birds. When it is flying to hunt, it retains itself in the air and turns, throwing several times into the water to catch a frog or a coot. A marsh harrier pulls a coot out of the water in this video and immediately begins to pluck its feathers. The western marsh harrier always carries its prey in its left leg's talons, but despite its size, many animals escape from its claws or form a massive gathering that attracts other aquatic birds, forcing the raptor to flee, abandoning its prey. In an open field, a marsh harrier stands on a coot it has captured. During incubation, the male feeds the female and the young after hatching. The female goes to meet the male, which is carrying a prey. She chases it for a few moments before it lands on the ground and gives the prey to the female, but it may also release the prey in flight while the female easily catches it. The marsh harrier in this video has already killed a coot and is making minced meat out of the dead bird. Perched on a tree branch overlooking a swamp, the harrier surveyed the water for signs of prey. A flock of coots soon appeared within its line of vision. The harrier then quickly swooped down and grabbed the coot killing it with furious pecks, using its sharp beak. Hiding behind a fallen tree trunk, the harrier began devouring the coot, which weighed at least one kilo until only its feathers were left. Number 13. Kestrel Attack Little Bird This kestrel took down a small bird, but when it heard something, it just took off with its prey. American kestrels are obligate carnivores, which means they can only eat other animals and cannot survive on fruits and vegetables. They will hunt grasshoppers, beetles, spiders, butterflies, moths, mice, shrews, and even bats, to name a few. Mouse-sized animals are nearly exclusively eaten by common kestrels. Voles, shrews, and real mice provide up to three quarters of biomass consumed by most individuals. This kestrel is eating another bird. This kestrel stands on its kill, a pigeon, and enjoys the fruits of its labor. Occasionally, it looks up to make sure it's not being stalked by some crazy predator that might want its lunch and the kestrel as dessert. Unfortunately, pigeons seem to be the food of choice for many birds looking to grab a quick meal. And besides being able to fly fast, there isn't much a pigeon can do to defend itself against a bird of prey attack. Number 12. Hornbill Hunting Lizard to meet its nutritional requirement, great pied hornbills eat fruit most of the time or are mostly frugivores. During breeding season or low fruit season, however, hornbills will prey on a variety of animals, including reptiles, such as the lizard in this video. Wildlife enthusiasts were lucky to find a pair of these magnificent birds because they are not as common as other birds. Two hornbills are perched up on a tree branch, but one of them has a lizard in its mouth and when the other takes off, it's time to eat for the hungry hornbill, and that's exactly what the bird with the large bill does. Number 11, Magpie versus Sparrow. A magpie destroys a sparrow in a parking lot right next to a car. 
The bird is tiny compared to the magpie, so it is an easy kill for the magpie. Magpies are not friendly birds, and they will often hunt and kill other birds out of spite. They are the bullies of the bird world. While jogging near a dock, a man was about to take pictures of a group of cute sparrows when a magpie swooped down and killed one of the small birds. Magpies have such an unpleasant temper that even eagles will sometimes attack them out of spite. A tiny baby squirrel is the latest victim of this magpie, and the bird doesn't waste any time killing it to say the least before it grabs the little rodent in its mouth and takes off with it. Number 10. Falcon Attacks Pigeon Peregrine falcons are top-tier aerial predators that can reach speeds faster than any other animal in the world. In a stoop, which is a rapid dive to catch prey, they can reach speeds over 200 miles per hour. In our thumbnail, a deadly falcon has just claimed its latest victim. The peregrine is a large and powerful falcon. It has long, broad-pointed wings and a relatively short tail. It is blue-gray above with a blackish top of the head and an obvious black mustache that contrasts with its white face. Its breast is finely barred. It is swift and agile in flight, chasing prey. A beautiful dove is captured by a falcon, and while it's still alive, it won't be for long after the falcon decides to kill it. Doves are beautiful birds, but they are vulnerable to all sorts of attacks by bigger and stronger predators, such as this falcon. This time, a pigeon takes a licking and is flown across a basketball court by a bird of prey. The natural predator of the pigeon is the peregrine falcon, one of the few birds that has the speed and maneuverability to outpace and catch a pigeon in flight. A peregrine falcon may chase a pigeon in one of two ways. The first method is the flat-out chase. Sometimes it works, but pigeons are fast too, and when jostling back and forth with a peregrine in this mode, prey will occasionally slip away. When this happens, the peregrine can recalibrate and switch to method number two. It's called the rapid stoop, the dive bomb. The attack begins slowly and then gradually picks up speed. With its wings tucked in, the falcon approaches 200 miles an hour. A falcon is flying in the sky and out of the blue snatches a dove just like that. It's as if the dove fell from the sky and was caught by the bird of prey. A peregrine falcon prefers to grab its food on the fly, slamming it with its fisted talons to kill it. The falcon swoops down to seize the bird if it is only stunned. Even though peregrines are only around the size of a crow, they can kill larger birds such as pigeons and ducks. It's safe to say that the dove will not be imprisoned for very long because it's already on its way into the kitchen to be prepped for lunch. Number 9. Eagle vs. Stork I guess a stork in this video went for a walk in the wrong neighborhood and quickly found out why when this martial eagle attacked and killed it. In this video, a black stork is attacked by a golden eagle in mid-air but manages to avoid being knocked out. The golden eagle is one of North America's largest, fastest, and most agile raptors. This bird of prey has long inspired both reverence and fear as it has been seen attacking large mammals or fighting off coyotes or bears. The stork must compete with some fish eagles as all the birds look for lunch in the water. The fish eagles are busy arguing between themselves while the stork swallows a fish. Number 8. Crow vs. Pigeon After demolishing a pigeon, a crow barely eats the bird, abandoning the carcass and taking off. Crows are opportunistic birds by nature, and unfortunately for pigeons, this means taking advantage of the opportunity to eat them simply because they are plentiful in most areas. A crow walks impatiently around a pigeon as the pigeon watches the crow before the crow attacks it. Crows find pigeons to be very easy prey, especially in areas where there is a lot of food in the streets. I think most birds find pigeons easy to kill. While a crow is busy murdering a pigeon, another crow watches his friend and even yells at him, asking him why it's taking so long. Crows are extremely intelligent birds capable of using tools, but they can be annoying and nasty at times, almost as much as magpies. When a timid crow tries to take advantage of a pigeon, the pigeon shows the crow it's not afraid of it as it charges and lunges at the black bird. Crows may not be typical aggressive birds, but when the situation calls for it, they can and will kill and eat a pigeon as part of their natural diet. After all, they are classified as predatory birds. 
Number 7. Owl vs. Squirrel and Chipmunk This is rare footage of a female barred owl eating a squirrel while her hungry baby owls call to be fed. After she finishes eating, she carries away the squirrel to feed the babies. This young barred owl was taking an interest in the squirrels in the yard, so the owner of the house filming this video took the liberty of throwing one of the squirrels towards the bird of prey to see what would happen. It doesn't take a genius to figure out, and you can see for yourself in this video. An eastern chipmunk emerges from hibernation as milder spring weather melts the snow in Canada, only to be pursued by a barred owl. Owls can hunt squirrels during the day and at night depending on the species. On the ground, squirrels are more vulnerable to owl attacks. An owl has a squirrel and holds it down on the branch it is perched on as it rips the small rodent apart. Number 6. Kokol Preying on Snake These two greater kokols find a snake on the side of the road and attack it. Both birds attack the head of the snake, but the snake manages to pull away for a moment before the final blow is delivered by the birds. A cobra finds out just how tough the greater kokol is as it tries to flee from certain death when the bird spots the snake and tries to kill it. The greater kokol is a common resident in Asia, ranging from India to South China and Indonesia. There are several subspecies, some of which are considered full species. It can be found in a variety of habitats. They eat small mammals like mice, reptiles like lizards, snakes, insects, centipedes, scorpions, spiders, crabs, snails, slugs, eggs, and nestlings of small birds, fruits, and seeds. It is terrestrial and skulking, stalks, walks, hops, and runs in pursuit of prey, creeps through shrubs and robs birds' nests. But in this case, it is eating a snake. These snakes seem to be having an argument or perhaps they are mating. I'm not a snake specialist, so I wouldn't know, but whatever they are doing, I'm sure they don't need a bird getting into their business. But this greater kokol insists and follows the snakes everywhere as if he's interested in a menage a trois. Either that, or he's looking for a two-for-one special snack. Number 5. Peregrine Falcon Hunting Sandpipers These birds, 200,000 of them, are on a huge migration from Canada's Arctic to South America. They stop here to feast on the shrimps, and they can't move until they have doubled in weight. Each small bird must harvest up to 20,000 shrimp in a single tidal cycle. But as the incoming tide pushes the sandpipers back up the beach, they have less room to maneuver and become easy targets for predators. The peregrine falcon, the fastest creature on Earth, scopes the area. The flock moves as one, trying to confuse the hunter. They dodge the first strike, but their nemesis gains height for an even faster attack. A weaker sandpiper is injured and snatched by the bird of prey. The peregrine falcon is a constant menace, but after 10 days of constant feeding, the sandpipers have put on enough weight to continue their epic journey. The person filming this video recently visited a place called Karana Vudan in County Galway in Ireland to do some bird watching. Birders had seen a few rarer species of waders, such as little ringed plovers, green sandpipers, and wood sandpipers. After arriving one evening, he spotted a peregrine falcon fly in and perch itself on a tree. The falcon waited about 10 minutes before going for the sandpiper. She failed at her attempt to capture the potential prey, but it was nice to see nonetheless. A large group of sandpipers were feeding at the mouth of a creek when the flock lifted. The man filming the video looked around for a raptor and, sure enough, a peregrine falcon came swooping down. It caught the hapless least sandpiper and took it to a partially exposed stump to eat its prey. When it was finished, the falcon stepped to the ground and wiped detritus off its bill on the sand and then climbed back up on the stump to clean up the residue in its talons. Number 4. Hawk vs. Crow The primary predators and natural enemies of crows and ravens are hawks and owls. Hawks attack, kill, and consume them during the day, while owls hunt them down on their roosts at night. Crows, on the other hand, prey on hawks and owls but do not eat them. Crows, in most cases, do not pose a threat to hawks, they are simply pests, much like a buzzing fly is to us. In normal mobbing situations, the hawks are unlikely to be physically attacked, and they may decide that vengeance is simply not worth the effort and energy. When this hawk decides it's time for breakfast, it puts an end to the crow's misery in an instant. I guess the crow didn't stand a chance. 
Crows appear to be no match for hawks, and every time these two birds collide, the outcome is the same. Here's a crow attempting to flee from a hawk. The hawk has it pinned down, and no matter how hard the crow tries, it can't get away. Crows surround the hawk to try and save their friend, but the hawk stands his ground and doesn't budge. The hawk eventually moves location with his prey, which is still alive, but the other crows follow the hawk with all the birds landing near a water hole. Some crows try their luck at freeing their friend and once again, the bird of prey will have none of it and resists all attempts. Number 3. Seagull vs. Rabbit Along with fully intact fauna, gulls can and will eat anything they can squeeze down their esophagus. This includes drywall, wax paper, large chunks of glass, aluminum, plastic, and styrofoam. All of these and more have been found inside the cast iron stomachs of these aviary journeymen. If you're wondering about the digestion of the rabbit in this video or the other random stuff that they inadvertently eat, these birds can regurgitate anything that upsets their rock-solid guts, ensuring that even the toughest sheetrock doesn't find its way onto your windshield. In this video, a seagull hunts and kills a rabbit on the island of Skellig off the coast of Ireland. There are many curious onlookers watching the bird in action, but it looks like the rabbit is not easy to swallow. Oh wait, no, it's all good. The seagull just swallowed it whole. Not only is this poor rabbit being hunted down by two seagulls, but the selfish birds want the squirrel all to themselves, so they decide to play tug of war with the small rodent and stretch it till it breaks, but I must say this squirrel looks like it's made of rubber. A seagull attacks a feisty squirrel with all the violence it entails, and even though the little rodent manages to give the bird a good fight, it's not enough to escape. Number 2. Black-Winged Kite-Killing Rodent after spotting a shrew on the ground, a black-winged kite did not need to be begged to attack and kill the shrew. The moment on camera shows the bird sinking its talons into the shrew, slowly killing it. In this video, a black-shouldered kite perched high up in a treetop can be seen feeding on a recently caught cane rat. This video is not for the squeamish, so if you keep watching, you can't say you were not warned. It's time for lunch for this black kite, and by the looks of it, this bird of prey has almost wiped its plate clean as it ripped to pieces what was supposed to be a rat. But hey, don't take my word for it, because at this point, it could have been any type of animal. I'm just reading my notes. Another black-winged kite can be seen devouring a rat it picked up on the fly before it perched itself on this tree branch to enjoy its meal away from the curious crowds. Number 1. Goshawk vs. Magpie A goshawk can be seen standing on a magpie with one talon disfiguring the magpie's face while it pecks at the magpie's chest with its pointy beak. This video shows a goshawk catching and eating two magpies. It is a place inhabited by magpies and they're the ones that started it when they decided to attack the goshawk. But they quickly found out that goshawks are not pigeons and were struck back and killed by the deadly bird of prey. After grabbing a magpie and being approached by the person filming, the goshawk in this video did not fly away. These birds of prey are bold and are not frightened easily, so the bird held his ground and continued what he was doing. After drowning a bird, a goshawk drags the dead bird out of the water and flies to a better hiding place so it could eat the bird in peace away from onlookers or possible intruders looking to steal it. Some of these hunts were out of this world. But watching the Peregrine Falcon in action was mind-boggling. Which one was your favorite? Why don't you let us know in the comments below? And well, that's it for now. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a like and let us know in the comments what you think. Check out our other videos and subscribe to be a part of the fun. Click on the notification icon so you can see our new videos as soon as they're uploaded. Thanks for watching and see you next time.